dictionary ripple effect effect okay the pronunciation effect um, let's imagine there is a guy he is walking on the street and uh, no let me take a step back there is this girl you know she always goes this direction to go to her house but today we don't know why you know she decided to take a longer walk and she goes this way so she passes a guy this guy finds her gorgeous so he turns around and looks at her but he's accompanied and he's accompanied by his girlfriend his girlfriend looks at him and says aren't you ashamed of doing that in front of me at this point you know he rem rem remembers that he's up to here with this idea of having just one girlfriend and not being able to you know enjoy life so he says yeah i i, I do that you know it's actually i like the freedom and actually i don't want anything else you know i want to break up you know the girl starts crying she gets her ring which was their engagement ring they were, they were going to get married by the way she throws the ring at his face and leaves you know he leaves again planning what kind of club he is going to visit later on right and now we have this ring on the street you know and then you are walking uh, you see this ring apparently there is a diamond but of course you don't believe it's a real diamond and it's real gold because you know people wouldn't throw uh, a ring like that on the street so you pick it up and uh, you meet your friend at the gym your friend is like pumping iron right Boop! and uh, as a joke you give the ring to your friend your friend finds it funny he laughs put his, puts the ring in his wallet and goes home when uh, he gets home uh, he picks up his wallet and the ring fell falls on the floor and his girlfriend, who, by the way, is very, very jealous, sees that. And uh, she looks at him and says, what the f is this? And uh, he gives the explanation, which is the truth, right? No, oh, my friend gave it to me as a joke at the gym. Your friend? Your friend gave you a ring like this? A ring that is worth like 2,000 reals as a joke at the gym? Of course, it's just now that the gym guy, let's call him this way, uh, has found out that the ring is actually quite expensive. And of course, his girlfriend understands everything about that. They start arguing, all right? And the girl doesn't believe him, and she breaks up with him. And the guy's devastated. You can't imagine. He really loved that woman. She didn't like him so much, you know, because you always have somebody in the relationship, always, that likes uh, one more than the other, you know. In our first relationship over there, the girl liked the boy more uh, than the other way around, and here it's the opposite, right? So she doesn't want to live with that suspicion all right of course the gym guy says that he can call you and you will confirm the story but do you think she'll believe like you one of your pals of course she won't believe uh you know so she breaks up with him and then the guy is devastated because this is the love of his life so he starts drinking and uh i don't know he stops going to the gym he doesn't eat healthy food anymore. He starts getting very late to his job. His boss goes up to him and says, Look, you have what is going on with you? You're usually, you know, the the most important member of this staff. And uh, you know, we miss your energy, you know, the company productivity is going down. And by the way, guys, this guy, the gym guy, is like the linchpin of the whole company you know like the cohesive uh, element of the whole company you know and uh, the gym guy is actually up to here with going to job and says okay i quit and the boss says no that's not what i meant and even offered him more money because the boss knows how important this guy is to the company but he says i quit all right 
uh, as an effect, a side story, the company uh, will lose more and more productivity and will bankrupt. Okay, but let's keep on with our uh, friend, the gym guy. So now he has much more time in his hands and, uh, you know, if you have an empty head, the devil will start living in your head, you know. And he's home all the time. He has some money, so he doesn't have to worry about that. So he has, he doesn't have any kind of obligation to go out of his house. And, you know, the devil is just reminding him of his lost girlfriend. And telling him that he, uh, you know... Uh, threw away everything and then he keeps thinking to himself what has he done uh, it can't be just because of a ring of course by now he doesn't talk to you anymore because you gave the ring to him in the first place right and uh, he gets more and more miserable he stops seeing his family his parents miss him a lot and one day he decides to let me see he decides to take some pills a lot of pills with lots of alcohol and you know what happened to him so his family is devastated you know his sister uh, starts drinking and uh, she starts going to weird parties you know and uh, picking up lots of boyfriends one after the other her life is a mess. His parents can't deal with this loss and they end up getting divorced, you know. And the father then, the gym uh, guy's father starts drinking, you know. And uh, this there's this day he's driving his car, he's completely wasted, right? And he hits somebody and he kills that person and he goes to jail because he killed that person guess who that person was the guy from the beginning of the story you know that broke up with his girlfriend because he saw another uh, girl and he wanted his liberty and by the way he was going to a nightclub you know to have fun well why have i told you this story because it came to my mind and uh you know I like to tell stories, but I've just described here a long, long line of rippling effect. You know, you throw a stone in the middle of a pond and then you see the ripples going and spreading and spreading. Remember, guys, the stone in our story was this girl who decided to go left instead of going right, you know, or right instead of going left. Uh, and by the way, I've just taught you the, the idea of karma as well, right? So this is the idea of rippling, rippling effect. Remember the, the, that movie called uh, Butterfly Effect, you know, uh, has exactly this, this idea in mind, you know. One event lets, leads to the other and to the other and to the other and you never know what will happen in the end. Just to give you some example with rippling effect, I know this video is extremely long for a dictionary entry, but uh, she always hoped that the kindness she showed others would have a positive ripple effect through her community, okay? Uh, I don't know if I said rippling effect, but it's ripple effect, okay? Uh, you know, she would help somebody, that person... Yeah, we, we, you have seen the videos uh, on Facebook, YouTube, whatever you use, like Instagram, like, oh, you give a person, uh, you know, some, some help, and then the person will help the other, and then you have a ripple effect, and you change the whole humankind. Second example there. Many people believe that the flapping of a butterfly's wing can cause a ripple effect that impacts the weather patterns hundreds of miles away. I've already told you about that. So think about it, you know? Now when you are leaving home, instead of going right, go left, and maybe you may end up destroying somebody's life. 